This thing on? This thing on? Do we have... Do we have a connection? Can y'all see me? What's good? Good morning. What's bracken? How's everyone doing? Good morning. Ha ha, what it do? We are moments away from seeing. Well, okay, let me let me let me not get ahead of myself. What's going on, guys? It is your boy TKD. Want to do here back here at PlayStation Source. I'm tired as hell. <laughs> I'm tired as hell, but we about to see this, all right? Now look. Uh I do have the Metacritic in a separate window ready to go, right? I do have it ready to, ready to go. It goes live in seven minutes, right? I see my boy Alejandro Caraballo. What's good, my boy? I saw you, bro. I see Delirious Tunes in the chat. I see you as well. What's good? Okay, guys, give me your last your last um, predictions for Ghost of Shishibi Metacritic. I believe on the bets and predictions episode, which y'all could tell me if I'm wrong. And yes, I did. My tweet wasn't lying. I do have this coffee. You see how fire this coffee looks? This coffee looks fire. I also have a banana, but I, I'm gonna eat this after. You know, I have a banana. I gotta get that. Gotta get that potassium in. The, the 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 potassium, potassium, potassium in. But I'm gonna wait to eat that at a later date. Uh, we have. SS9 by oh I can't say your whole name. He says 89, 83, 80, 87, 90, 90. So we have a few people that are with me on that 90 train. We we have a few, Christian Buckley says I forgot my prediction, but I'll say 74. Damn! 74? Come on, Christian. 74. 70. Okay, you know, I mean, you know what? Who knows? We'll see. We'll see. Christian, you already know it's Kevin Bustello. You already know Kevin Bustello. You already know. We got 93. 87, 86, 92, 11 out of 10. Damn, 11 out of 10, huh? Okay, okay. Uh, I think, so, I have, I did raise my my prediction um, to, like, a 90. Uh, I did it on um, on Road to Ghost of Shishima. I did it to a 90. Um, but hey, before we continue, make sure uh, everyone down below in the description, you can follow our Discord, our Twitter, as well as our Anchor link to listen to our long form content and podcast. So I'm right that, of course, we wrote to Part Two and Road to Ghost of Tsushima, as well as if you want, you can of course subscribe to the channel. As well as down below, you can hit that join button to uh, support the boy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, either at the King tier or the Prince tier. There we go. And uh, get get access to ex exclusive emotes. If you become a king tier, you can of course, uh, you know, have your name shouted out on every video or every piece of podcast as well. Make sure to do all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Really hope. Okay, uh, let's see. Really hoping this game would be nice to go out on the banger. Oh, this is. I think. I think this is gonna be. I think this is this is gonna be a nice way to end off the PS4 era. Christian Buckley says second son Metacritic is an 80 for reference. That's the thing, right? So like I do I I have been saying that I think this game is gonna be looked at better and more fondly than than Second Son. I don't think that's outlandish to say, you know what I'm saying? So we have a lot of people hovering in the eighties and nineties, you know what I'm saying? Which the the eighties I could definitely see this game getting an 80. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could definitely see this game getting an 80. So you think uh, this is going to score less than Second Son? No, I personally think it's going to score more than Second Son. I think. I I I personally feel that way, you know? I hope it's 95, but you know Xbox people will bring down that score. Hell of a you already know. This game is going to be breath of, gonna be a breath of fresh air, bro. I'm excited for this game. I'm excited for A, but did y'all um oh and then uh, thank you, Christian. He says first light is seventy three. Did y'all see um not the launch trailer, but the cinematic trailer that they put out, like I think like last week or so? That trailer is fire. That one's real good. 
That one's real, real good. Someone upload a video of the intro and prologue on. Oh, someone did. I'm gonna stay away from that because you already know we're gonna start the Ghost of Shishima stream series um, on Thursday night. Oh, by the way, guys. Okay, so streaming plans. Okay, on the channel, streaming plans. Okay, streaming plans. Today we are going to. So the. By the way, okay, for people that are coming in, the reviews come out in three minutes. In three minutes, we're gonna refresh Metacritic and look at the score. But in terms of streams, we are going to um, finish God of War Ascension tonight. We did a four-hour stream last night. We made a lot of progress. We have ten more chapters in that game. We are going to beat it tonight. And then Wednesday, your boys can take a little break from streaming. All right? There will still be videos up, but we're going to take a little break from streaming. You know what I'm saying? For for tomorrow, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hang out with the family, you know? But then Thursday night, be here to watch Ghost of Tsushima get played, stream series, my entire first playthrough uh, will be streamed here on the channel. I keep looking over here. I need to look over here. <laughs> I keep looking over here. I need to look over here. Okay. Uh, so, uh, one playthrough normal, one playthrough cinematic with subs. Ooh, okay. I mean, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know. We'll see. I'm more of like, uh, for the, for the stream series, I'm more of like, all right, like, let's, let's, let's stream it, beat it once. You know what I'm saying? Then we'll go uh, do all the good stuff. Um, but also make sure to like, keep it locked here on the channel because on Sunday, you all will get Road to Ghost of Shima as you all have been getting the past few weeks. And Road to Ghost of Shima this week will cover our first impressions. Uh, myself and the Iraq Knight will be uh, doing our first impressions of Ghost of Tsushima, so hype to see that. Uh, again, uh, this game is about to ruin my whole relationship. Yo, I already told my friends, look, the same deal for Last of Us Part 2 is probably going to be longer because this game is 100% probably going to be longer than Last of Us Part 2. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, so I'm going to, you know. Hi, who are you again? I am uh, TKD123. I uh, Do you play the source? Links below in the description. Drinking that coffee Bustelo. You gotta love it. This is damn good coffee, man. It's damn good. It's damn good. I love the Road to Ghost of Tsushima series. I love you guys for supporting the series. Much love. For real. Oh, shit. It's almost 7. Okay. All right, guys. Here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go over here to, to, to bop to this scenario. We're gonna go over here. I'm gonna start the refresh. I'm gonna start the refresh. Okay, we got we got nothing yet. It's quiet on the open front still. It's quiet. It may take a little bit for it to pop. It may take a little bit for it to actually like initiate and pop. Damn, I got hella ads. I got hella ads. Your hair just Denzel, my hair, yo, it is 7 a.m. <laughs> I just woke up. Can a man relax? Can a man get up and talk about Metacritic right quick? Shit. <laughs> I know my... Listen, I know my hair is very disrespectful right now. I promise it will get cleaned up and fixed up by tonight's stream, okay? I see my boy Chungi in the chat. How you doing, my boy? I see you, King. I see you. I see you. We see 94, 100... 84, 94. I'm still waiting for this thing to pop up a score. Hold up. I'm going to go back to the main menu and see what we got. I need that Ghost of Shim. Oh, okay. There. I go. Oh, man. <sighs> we still don't got a score yet, guys. We waiting. We waiting. It's all good. Oh, wait, I see my boy, the Gurin guy. Oh, I see you, my boy. I see you, bro. Yo, me and you got a, we, um, got a chat on some, on some Spider-Man Miles Rouse videos, man. We definitely got to do that. We definitely got to do that. 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 Also, shout out to the mods doing their thing in the chat. Much love to you all. Much love. I see you. Christian, I see you. Thank you for the mod stats, bro. Thank you for doing your thing. Chungi as well. I see you. I see you modding it up to chat. Love you. Love you, King. It's an 84. Damn, why can't why isn't it popping yet? Do y'all see this? I'm like re I'm refreshing. 
Okay, how how are people saying that they can see the score, but I can't? What's going on? Here, we're we're gonna go all the way back out. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna. See. Oh wow, damn! Why am I all caps? Why am I screaming? Let's see. I swear I don't have a score yet, guys. I don't have a score yet. Push Square released theirs. Um, yeah, we'll. I kind of want to go and shop around. You know what? Okay, while we while we wait for Metacritic, that's a good idea. Let's check out Push Square. Let's let's check out their review. One of the greatest open world generations. Okay, do we'll we'll read the last paragraph and then their uh their nine out of ten. Okay. So pros are great story moments, some gripping main missions, excellent combat system, fantastic character progression, incredible atmosphere, beautiful guy the open world, top tier photo mode, a little unpolished in places, and some forced stealth some forced stealth sections. Interesting. Alright, their conclusion goes. Ghost of Tsushima is a joy to play and a joy to behold. Sucker Bunch has crafted one of the most memorable open world games of this generation, uh, buoyed by an immensely satisfying combat system and engaging dramatic story unlike many of its open world peers. It's refined and focused experience gripping and immaculately, immaculately presented at its best. A first, a fitting first party swan song for the PlayStation 4. Okay. got that. Now, again, you know, again, you know, um... It is, it is, it is push square. That is a, why don't I have a score yet? I'm so sad. Um, you know, that's a, that's a play website. Let's, let's, let's hop over to IGN. Let's hop over to IGN. Let's see what IGN got. Let's see what they got. Let's see what they got. Go to Shima. Let's see here. Damn, yo, IGN's lagging right now. Is that my connection or what? People are saying 84, but where are you guys getting 84, though? Where are y'all getting 84? I want to know. Are so many people trying to hit the IGN review that it's not loading? Oh, damn, that's wild. IGN? I see that top bar moving. I see it moving. I see it moving. Okay, let's try Metacritic again. Nope, don't get Metacritic yet. Yo. Is IGN bugging right? Wait, can I upload? I mean, can I go to any store right now? Can I just hold up? Is, why is IGN bugging? Yo, is my computer bugging? Is IGN bugging? What's good? Can nobody... Do, do, boom, 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 boom. Ain't nobody... Do y'all want some music to play? Oh, wait. Uh, Can I play music in the background? I think I can. If I keep it super low, I can do that. I can do it with some beats. I think if I, if I play it like that. Yeah, I can play super low. I, I, I could play low music. You know what I'm saying? Some of the samurai hip hop that I put on the Ghost of Shishima videos. You know? Get a little some some. There we go. A little. A little flavor, you know what I'm saying? A little fire. Uh, what's up, Ryan Rob Eleven? Nah, we're still trying to look at uh, the scores. Mmm. Is, is this too loud? Let me know if the music is too loud. Doom, doom, doom. Meta Craig is annoying for me either. Okay, yeah. IGN is truck. Okay, they originally had the review, and now it's taking downloads. Okay, you know. Okay, okay. So who's who's reviews are up right now? Gamespot is up. Let's let's look at Gamespot. Easy eyes to eight point five. Okay, we can go hop there. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Seven out of ten for Gamespot. Okay, let's read the last paragraph, and we'll we'll see what the overall consensus is. You know. Also, I implore everyone to go and uh, read. All the uh, reviews that we see here. Ghost of Tsushima's story hits hard in the game's third and final act and ends in, sp in a spectacular fashion. It left me with the same kinds of strong emotions I felt at the end of all of my favorite samurai film epics and had me eager to watch them all again. The game hits a lot 
of fantastic cinematic highs and those ultimately lifted above the trappings of its familiar open world quest design and the innate weaknesses that come with it but those imperfections and dull edges are definitely still there ghost of Tsushima is at it's best when you're riding your horse and taking in the beautiful world on your own terms. Armed with a sword and a screenshot button allowing the environmental cues and your own curiosity to guide you. It's not a Criterion classic, but a lot of time it sure looks like one. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay, I see that. I see that. Is the game... Sorry. Is the... Uh, is the... Uh, instrumentals too high on the stream? Let me know, guys. Let me know if the instrumentals are too much. Um, also, I'd love to see 200 people here in the chat. Make sure to leave a like on the stream as well as down below in the description. You can follow our Twitter, our Discord, as well as, as, well as our Anchor link to listen to our long-form content and podcast format. That, of course, in Road to Part 2 and Road to Ghost of Tsushima. So, it's down below. You can become a member of the channel. You know, hit that join button. Support the boy. Support me. And, uh, you know, subscribe at that... At that um, Prince tier or King tier. I can probably talk today. Damn, I'm, I'm, I'm so tired, guys. <laughs> okay, let's refresh Metacritic. We should check Open Critic, too. I just realized that. Metacritic, I still don't have a score yet. I still don't have a score. I'm sure they're still aggregating everything. Damn, my my my, my thing is lagging. Hold up. The music's all good. We love to see it. We love to see it. Love to see it. Love to see it. Okay, th okay, actually here, I, something I just saw notified for me here. Let's go to Twitter real quick. And let's head over to Nibel's Twitter. Hold up. Because he has a great roundup of a few scores. There we go. So we have Game Informer 9.5, Destructoid 9.5, IGN 9, Easy Allies 8.5, Press Start 8.5, 6th the the sixth axis at eight usg four to five GameSpot seven vg247 three out of five vgc three out of five metacritic 84 with 48 critics and open critic at 86 there we go there we go so uh, yo i think with 84 i definitely know that iraq knight won the won the metacritic bet <laughs> i i i definitely got cocky and uh, shot a little bit too high, you know, for sure, for sure. Because originally, I've been saying, hey, you know, I think this game is, uh, you know, high, high, high 80 range, right? And like, hey, you know, it's not over. Everyone's not, everyone's uh, re reviews are in, but uh, we all knew this was going to be like an 8, you know. I think I was just being cocky. I just wanted it to be like really good, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to White Wolf for uh, uh, following the Twitter, and you guys can follow as well. You know what I'm saying? Why do I not? Yo, is my is my thing bugging? I really want to see the Metacritic score. Oh, here it is. Here we go. It popped. 84. Okay, 84 on Metascore. Okay. Less with 48 critic reviews going in. So we, we still got plenty to roll in, but let's look at some of these. Oh, hold up. Christian sent me something about about the homie grub. The 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 homie grub snacks? Hold up. The homie Jeff Grub. What did what did what did he say? Let's see. I I had to stop playing Ghost to get Paper Mario, but my early impressions mostly agree with Mike. It's a good game, but AC Ossie is still better. If you like the setting and characters, it'll hold up though. Interesting. Oh shit. Cause listen. Y'all know. If you don't know, now you'll know. I love Assassin's Creed Odyssey. You know, shameless plug. Shameless plug. On Joy Clicks, uh, we are doing once no, uh Joy, Joy Clicks Games Cast last week. Uh we did our top ten games of all time, and AC Odyssey is indeed on that list for me personally. Like I love um I love AC Odyssey. T underscore saw in the chat says, "How is eight not good?" No, I think I think eight is a great score. I, I think I think eight is exactly what Ghost of Shima was 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 feeling like. I see you, Brody. Shot to you following the following the Twitter. Much much love if you're watching. Much love, much love. Um, but let's check out some of the Metacritic scores. Let's see what we got. Let's read some things. 
because I like when Metacritic has like their their nice little like consensus write up, and then we get to go into uh, the nitty gritty of what everyone's saying. Um, I want, I want I want to read the lowest score actually. Did you download it? Okay, here let's let's read. Wait, we were at GameSpot. Guess I was a seventy. Damn, I totally forgot about that. Let's read VG247, actually. I want to read this one. Okay, so VG, VG247 says, VG247 <clears throat> says, it has its moments, but like like Jin Sakai in the opening hours, the past holds it back. It's open world, the video game. It's far too easy, too. The lack of consequence for failure makes it feel like you're just going through the motions. If you'll excuse the wind-based pun, it's a breeze. <laughs> it's a breeze. Death Stranding is an 85, and it was the PSS GoD last year. It's true. Very, very true. Hey, 80s are good games. 80s are good games. You know what I'm saying? 80, 80s are good games. For sure. Uh, but that's a funny-ass pun. It's a breeze. While playing it, I often found my mind wandering, but the third and final act, I just wanted to be over. Like the Samurai Ghost of Tsushima feels like a relic of a bygone era guy era damn damn a bygone era okay i feel like oh wait i'm trying to think of which i feel like all of ign's um branches in other countries seem to be super critical on a lot of reviews they do you know like i feel like ign prime tends to rank their games or rank games like a little bit higher than their other subsidiary, uh, not like subsidiary, but like their other branch uh, networks. But let's read IGN Italy, give it 75. Ghost of Tsushima is a love letter to the, oh God, here we go, guys. Chambara. Chambara. Movies and delivers great atmosphere and stylish visuals. But Sucker Punch's open world fails to bring a compelling and cohesive experience gameplay wise. With its highs, duels, mythic, qu mythic quests. Mythic quests? Mythic quests. We haven't heard about that yet. We haven't heard about that yet. W what's a mythic quest? That's my question. What is a mythic quest? That sounds mad interesting. But, um... Okay, let's let's read what they have to say. Uh, where is that? Where am I reading? Oh, here it is. And Lowe's open world structure and quests as a whole, Ghost of Tsushima is an average game and sadly feels like a lost opportunity to bring players uh, the definitive samurai experience. Man, that that hurts because I know the studio, uh, you know, of course, the good homies at Sucker Punch, they were really, really doubling down on like all right like we want this to be like the ultimate like samurai role-playing game you know that one hurts that one that one that one hurts for sure that one hurts that one hurts um let's see who else we got let's see what comes to my eye uh games we has a has short one it's not bold enough to be excellent but ghost of Shima is enjoyable enough to keep fans uh of these kinds of map games busy and happy for a good while okay i see i see uh, Christian Buckley says in the chat, I'm reading Patrick Kleppett's review on Vice. He's talking about it the way I was worried. Pretty visuals, but standard open world that is kind of average. Interesting. 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 Maybe you get bigger rewards from Mythic Quest? Yeah, dude. I'm, I, I just want to know what the hell a Mythic Quest is, honestly. It sounds fire. Uh, Let's see. I feel like Osushima is getting re re realistic reviews unlike other games. I feel that. I feel that. Skill up loves the game. Okay, I mean, I mean, here's the thing, right? I think I'm gonna end up really, really liking the game. Um, and I feel, um, well, I mean, let me not say that. Well, no, I think it's fine. I feel like I'm probably gonna like this game because if if we're hearing AC Odyssey is being brought up into this in terms of like an open world, then like, give me that. You know, that that sounds good to me. Oh, it went down. It's at a A3 now. Wait, let me let me go back and go back in. Let me see. For me, it says 84 still. It may it may still need to pop up on my end, but it says uh, 84 still for me. 
Chungi says, uh, open world games with no guys are kind of hard to beat, in my opinion. Oh, no, I mean, yeah, absolutely, absolutely, yeah, absolutely. I feel that. The Metacritic score is 86 now? Oh shit. That mean yo, if, it, listen, I think Arachnid said 86. Should we call Arachnid right now? I want to ask him. I know it's super early, but, I can, no, let me not, because I know for sure he's definitely not awake right now. He is definitely sleeping. I know that. He is definitely sleeping. He is, that man is not up. That man is, let's read US Gamer. US Gamer says Sucker Punch, Sucker Punch's first stab at a stealth action adventure hits the mark. The island of Tsushima is a beautiful backdrop for this tale and revenge and honor. The, uh, sorry, and honor and the environmental art is a visual treat. Combat and stealth are largely solid, though. There are issues with the camera and hitting the right targets. The biggest stumble comes with the Japanese vocal track. <gasps> no. 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 With the vocal track? Oh, shit. Which isn't synced correctly with the character's lips. A shame for a game like this. That is sad. Ghost of Tsushima isn't the most innovative way to end the generation, but it's a fun one. Oh, that is so upsetting. That is sad. Damn. Oh, that is that one hurt. The Japanese voice track is out of sync. Hey yo. 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 Oh yeah. Um. Okay. I see. Artemis is chat. Hey yo. We all know that scores don't mean end all be all. You know. Um. Like I. You know. I don't even like re really take other people's like. Uh, uh, you know, scores into account of what I, I of like how I feel about the game for sure. You know what I'm saying? But like, um, I think it's cool to like see the whole parameter in terms of like the critical reception and how that reflects off of the player base's reception of the game. Because like, for example, famously, uh, you know, interesting, interestingly enough, you know, the other uh, PlayStation Open World game that came out most recently was of course Days Gone, and how that critical reception was vastly different than the player base's reception of the game um granted that one's a little bit different because days gone the build that the critics got was a very very broken botched up build of the game you know what i'm saying and uh the players were able to play with that day one patch and with other patches throughout the first and uh the first week or two and stuff like that so uh we felt a lot better about days gone overall you know what i'm saying um uh so it's I just, I just, I just want to see how the critical reception reflects against the uh, player base's reception, you know. But definitely, you're right, 100%. Scores are not the end all be all. Totally not. Totally not. Totally not. Let's read Easy Allies. Uh, they say, Ghost of Shima has a lot going for it. Combat is fast and fluid, and the story is engaging thanks to some great characters. Most disappointing is that a stealthy approach can sometimes be can sometimes make, make victory feel simple and unearned despite that oh interesting so like i guess they're alluding here that like the ghost route in some instances is like super super easy interesting oh how long to be i don't know if we'll get how long to be chungi until the game comes out and like maybe like a week after or whatever like i don't think we'll get like accurate 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 I don't think we'll get accurate uh, times unless people say here in the in the uh, in the reviews. I'm expecting a 40 hour game. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I'm expecting a 40 hour game for sure. I was expecting a 40 hour game, and we do know also. And oh wait, let me let me finish reading before. Uh, okay. Despite that, the island itself is the biggest draw, taking you on a captivating adventure through its beautiful world. I'm excited for the world, dude. At least everyone's saying that, hey, yo, this this world looks beautiful. Ooh. Looks looks beautiful. Let's read, like, okay, what's the highest score? Damn, people gave it 100? Screen gave it 100? A perfect score for real? Let's read Game Informer. <laughs> Excuse me. Ah. Uh. 40, 40, 50 hour game? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it definitely makes sense. Like, I, it sounds like 
it sounds like this is going to be like a a a range of like five by seven remake. So like, uh, like like around like forty to fifty, yeah, for sure. I beat five by seven remake in like forty three hours, I think, or forty four hours, something like that. I forgot forty two to forty four. Game Informer says Ghost of Tsushima captures the mystique, fierce violence, and barely contained emotional angst. Uh, of the great samurai films. The line of inspiration is clearly purposeful. Sucker Punch included a gorgeous Kurosawa mode, which sets a black and white film grain and audio treated effect that doubles down on the classic cinematic vibe. It's well worth turning on, if only for a few missions. But even beyond that cool feature, this is a game that nails uh, the aesthetic it's shooting for, firmly establishing itself as the medium's defining samurai saga. Dark Angel, I feel you on The Last of Us 2, bro. I feel you on that. They downgraded the graphics a little bit. Yeah? Hmm. Oh, well, I guess we can look at gameplay, too. I guess we can look at people's gameplay on the reviews, too. And the video reviews. Or is this all from... These all look like it's from the trailer, actually. Wait, I just want to scrub through... Push square to the any footage. Oh, they got some new footage on this. Hold up. Oh, they got some new footage, bro. Look at that snow. Are y'all seeing that? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. IFC Gamer, people are saying that the um, that the length is around 40 to 50 hours. Brian Altano says 50 plus hours so far. Check it. Okay, perfect. Okay, yeah. Let's before we do, yeah before we continue on that. Let's let's let let us look at the homie Brian Altano's. Uh... Oh wait, hold up. I see you, Tyna. Thank you for uh, following that PSR's Twitter. I see you. I see you. I see you. Let's let's look at Agent Bizzle's thread on Ghost of Shima. Let's see what we got. Okay. I genuinely loved my 50 hours with Ghost of Shima. A sprawling, beautiful, and consistently captivating open world game that balances tranquility and conflict expertly. It's got some of the usual open world hangups, but it also adds a lot of really brilliant ideas to it. I played most of the game in black and white, foam grand Kurosawa mode with the Japanese voiceovers and English subtitles, which was aside from a few side missions uh, that debated the color, completely sublime. And just consistently goddamn gorgeous. The art direction is phenomenal. Screen Rant says Ghost of Shima is the best Assassin's Creed. Yeah, I mean, I could definitely see how someone could say that for sure, 100%. That said, the game is utterly stunning in color too. I often explore new areas like this uh, and get the feel of them before popping back into black and white. The game has my favorite and most used and easily accessible photo mode ever put in a game and tons of, and tons of photograph. Dude, are you kidding me? Look at these fucking shots, dogs. Y'all, are y'all serious? Bro. Damn. Oh, this photo mode about to go in. This photo mode about to go in. At first, I thought the follow the wind to your objective mechanic was a bit gimmicky, but in practice, it's a brilliant way to keep your screen clear of giant hideous arrows and waypoints that usually clutter games in this genre. And I hope lots of other developers take notes. Oh man, he's getting really good. Yo, he's getting really good full of more shots. Dude. That's crazy. Damn. That's fire. Okay, that was well, well worth going to that one. Well worth going that one. I guess it is. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. It's early morning allergies, y'all. It's early morning allergies. I promise I am still quarantining, all right? <laughs> I swear. Oh, man. I want to see some more visuals from uh, Push Square's review. Let's look. Let's see. Oh, check out that armor. Check out that armor. Oh, yo, this is like the beginning of the game, though. You know what? Let me stop looking at this. Never mind. I don't know why I'm doing this. 
I, I know I'm doing this. <laughs> Thank you, Samurai. Thank you, Samurai. Thank you for that. Bless you. I sh shoot, I'm trying to think. Will I get in trouble for, for watching these, these reviews on stream? Shoot. Uh, maybe not. We'll see. Fuck it. Damn, yo. This looks fire. Are you serious? That looks beautiful. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Rockstar has the wizards over there. Uh, this one made by Rockstar. Oh, well. They, they definitely have wizards over there, but it's not by Rockstar. I mean, hey. Look, I am. I know I'm a little bit in the minority in this whole thing. Um, but I love the new uh assassin's creed open world rpg-esque type of games i freaking love those like i love odyssey with all my heart odyssey is fucking phenomenal um so this game is like the japanese version of that with a really cool story i'm with it i'm with it i'm with it you know kevin what do you prefer to play ghost shima colored or black and white i'm a sucker chungi chungi i'm a huge sucker and christian can attest to this for sure I'm a sucker for vibrant, punchy colors. Like, even if they look a little bit, like, um, not realistic to a certain degree, I love punchy, very, very vibrant colors. Like, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a colors, you know, type of guy. You know what I'm saying? I love colors. Um, so if, so if it looks, so I'm definitely playing in that color mode for sure. But I'll probably pop in the mission too to try that, uh, uh, black and white kurosawa mode for sure i'll i'll pop it on like a few times here and there i don't like current has screen, which right i mean like hey there's plenty of people that 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 don't like the current ac games like that's that's totally fine i'm not saying like it's wrong or whatever you know what i'm saying i i know like i'm a little bit not i don't know about minority but i'm definitely on a subsect of assassin's creed fans that like the open world rpg assassin's creed games i totally get that for sure um, but I, I love open world RPG Assassin's Creed games. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get Origin after I finish lots of, dude, honestly, Desire, Origins and Odyssey are long as hell, right? So I would honestly low key recommend you just wait till Valhalla. If I'm going to be a hundred percent real with you, unless like you like the Egyptian, uh, uh, you know, historical, um, part, or if you like, uh, What's the name? Um, if you like Greece and stuff like that, you know, and like Greek history, then by all means. Oh, hold up. Wait, I did want to see this menu. Okay, hold up, guys. We need to investigate this motherfucker. Hold up. Hold up. We're, we're, we're going to put... Okay, right here. What we got? So the techniques, we have Samurai, Stantis, and Ghost. Oh, so Mythic Quest allow you to master legendary combat arts? Exploration, harness the power of the guiding wind. Okay, so this will reveal more stuff via the guiding wind. Okay, I see that. Uh, deflection and evasion. Okay. I need to go in that stances tab, yo. I want to see what the stances there are in the game. Okay. Oh, wait. No, I'm wrong. So, so Samurai tab has all this. And then we'll have a separate ghost tab that probably has all of this too, and like it's reflection of that. Okay, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, what else we got? <laughs> Bashful Broly says Sherlock mode activated. I'm, bro, I gotta go into this tab, man. I gotta see what's good with the menus, bro. I gotta see what's good with the menus. Okay, so he has uh all uh, these are I think they're the technique points. These uh these these things here. Can I see my yeah, it's me a mouse. Uh, let's see, so deflection, okay, so perfect parry, yep, I know you can get that, earns a moderate amount of resolve, uh-huh, which of y'all re remember the video I made a few weeks ago, resolve is the, uh, the orange, no, not, not orange, the, like, gold orbs on the bottom left of your screen, okay, roll, okay, so double tap to roll, oh, okay, 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 show me that, all right, so you unlock perfect parry, and roll. Interesting. Okay, I see now. Oh, it looks like if you look over here, yo, there's some deflection that gives you health. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hold up. I like that. I like that. There's a horsey. Oh, maybe to like get out of the way. Like just extinguish is burning. Yep. Uh huh. Makes sense. Makes sense. 
slot. Go over some more stuff. Go over the more stuff. Come on. Go down. Go down. Go down. Damn it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yo, look at that cliff, though. Oh, we're about to be using the screenshot mode, bro. I Like, because on, on streams, y'all know I don't really mess around with photo mode on streams. Just because, like, I don't want, you know, a lot of, like, time to be spent on photo mode. But, like, well, at least while I'm streaming. But there's a plenty of screenshot moments in this game, seemingly. That that shot looks very different. That shot looks different. That shot looks different in terms of the uh, intro to Road to Ghost. But so I think the these little markings here, I think, is what it's talking about when you can upgrade the guiding winds to show you more stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is that? Or is that just, like, enemies that are tagged in the open world? But then the, there's also a Guiding Wind lo logo right here. I'm not sure what, what, what that's all about. Hmm. Three days is so long. Bashful, I know, bro. It's so long. Well, AC games were copy-paste with low improvements, but changing the whole genre it was a drastic move. Yeah, for sure. Because the change of style has not been done properly. They are not high-quality games, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to sit here and say that, like, AC Odyssey is, like, a ref you know, like super refined, but like, goddamn, I, I, I love it, guys. I don't want to tell y'all. I don't know. I can't lie to y'all. I love Assassin's Creed. I love Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Like, it's, it's, it, it, it's a phenomenal game. To me, I don't know why it just hit, just perfect. Is he gonna steal that? Damn, I'm just murdering homies. Damn. I do like... I do like how going into an encampment type thing, they have these mini... Uh, challenges. You know, like here, defeat the Mongols, um, stagger enemies with a heavy attack, or find and observe the Mongol leader. Okay, I like that. I like that. Like, just little bonus things to... Uh, to, like, spice up whatever. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but Doom is just a fun game to go to. I mean, it's a pretty good game, but game of the year, I wouldn't give it a towel because it's just killing and killing. Doom Eternal is a lot more than just killing and killing. Like, like, like there is a, there's a really expanded, uh, like, flow and methodology of combat that I would compare it to, like, a dance type thing. Like, it only makes sense when you play it. Like, there... There's something about Doom Eternal's combat that's just phenomenal, in my opinion. I love Doom Eternal. So I will if someone wants to make that goatee, I will I will defend that, you know. I will definitely defend that uh that argument. Bashful says, did, did you talk about the bow thing? Because there are more powerful arrows. That's why the person flew when getting hit. Yeah, yeah. I think we knew that. I think we knew that. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Damn, I, I thought it was different bows, though. I know it was the arrow. Interesting. Interesting. Should I put PS5 star up sound for my feature channel intro? Absolutely. Why not? Why not? Do it. Do it, King. Optional? Um, Yeah, yeah. They're like optional ob ob objectives. Yeah, yeah. They're just like little extra things that you can do if you want to. You know what I'm saying? That I assume reap more rewards, you know? So... I like that sidestep. Okay. Okay. Oh, you get it in the... Oh, yo, did, did y'all see that indicator when someone's aiming at you with the bow? Did y'all see that? See that right there? This thing right here? That's cool. Devil Shooter, I see you, my boy. Welcome to the stream. Will Ghost Machine must still look amazing on PS4 Slim? That's, that's a great point. Um... It most 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 likely it will, you know, of course, because it seems like all the first party. Okay, the score did go down to an eighty-three, which is which is to be expected. If we're being honest here, that one that one's to be expected for sure. Eighty-three, hey man, you can't you can't you can't hail an eighty-three. On the main page, it's not updating, but okay, there it is. Oh, there it is. Excuse me. It makes sense. It makes sense for eighty-three. Definitely makes sense. Let's put a little bit more of that. T 
Damn, Jin, chase after that man. Yo, relax. There seems to be a guy that was fighting with with you and then died. Wait, what? Oh, this double shooter. Yes. Yo, this game by the look fire on PS4 Pro. Let's get it. Now, I did hear, I did hear rumblings on Twitter yesterday of this game having a performance mode. And best believe, y'all, I am playing that performance mode. Give me all the frames I can get. Give me all the frames I can get. Give me all them frames. You know what I'm saying? Give me all them frames. Uh, we're about to have so many good screenshot moments, y'all. Thursday night is going to be lit. Oh, man. This this about to be crazy. It looks super good. Players will see it as Nani, I bet. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, 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 maybe. That's for Brody. Hey, man. If you get in PS5, I, I, I think investing in a 4K display might be the move, too, as well. You know what I'm saying? Um... I have a 4K monitor that I'm looking at right now, but forget PS4, PS5, PS5, baby. Oh, devil, I see you. I see you, my boy. I see you. I see you. I see you, king. What are you most looking forward to about Ghost of Tsushima? That, that's a very good question. Um, Very good question. Um, Honestly, what am I most looking forward to? Honestly, I, this may be a cop-out answer, but definitely the scenic views. Like, I can't wait to see, like, the little moments in between mission to missions and, like, Story beat the story beat. Like, I want to, like, see and have, like, those, like, campfire-esque stories where, like, hey, like, you know, I was heading to this mission and I saw a fox. And, like, this fox took me down this, like, amazing scenic route to go to a uh, Inari shrine. And I, you know, just did something small. But, like, it was something, like, so, uh, you know, like, beautiful. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, like, looking for those, like, little moments in between main missions um and probably like number two is that for the story because like the whole prospect of a samurai you know going um quote unquote like against the bushido well not even quote unquote he is going against the code to defend shishima against mongol invasion like like that whole plot is really interesting to me too you know what i'm saying is that my boy top toppy what moza bro i remember you bro i remember you g Shout out to you, bro. Thursday is going to pop off, bro. We're going to be we gonna be lit here on PlayStation Source. Uh, to come 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 Thursday for sure. Th that thing going to be fire. Thing going to be fire. Yeah, the yeah the PS5 is a uh, wait a lot, allegedly, so I hear. Allegedly, 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 allegedly. Bachelor Bros, it's definitely saving our phone. Oh, absolutely, bro. Absolutely. Absolutely. Hold up. Psycho, someone... Wait, yo, Psycho, can you tell me which review said that? One review for Ghost of Shima stated that Last of Us 2 story resonated better because it was an American story written by Americans? What type of BS is that? See that questions, why should players pass on Ghost of Shima? Questions, why should players... Okay, wait, see that? Questions, why should players pass on? Interesting. Well, let's go over there real quick. Wait, go back. Did you see... Hold up, hold up, wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, Tommy, Tommy, hold up. Tommy, hold up, wait, 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 wait. Where? Hold on. Like, right, 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 right here? Wait, Tommy, be more specific. I want to see what Tommy said. <laughs> I want to see what Tommy's talking about. Is it back a little bit more? Are you talking about how he just stabbed him in the chest? They, they gave it a six.
The in games, yo. Thiago is what I'm thinking too. The in game soundtrack is going to be flame, bro. It has to be fire. It has to be fire. The screen faded like like Jin focused. Oh wait, I did see that. Wait, I know what you're. Wait, I did see that. Wait, where is that? I know. Wait, I I know what you're talking about. Wait, I think it's over here. I don't. I think we're talking about. Wait, where the hell is that? I remember seeing that. I remember seeing that too. Wait, 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 wait. I totally remember seeing that. We need, yo, guys, listen. Hot take. I fucking hate sushi. <laughs> Sushi's garbage. I love, I love Chinese food. I, I, I'm, I, I'm a big fan of Chinese food, right? But sushi can um get the hell off my plate, bro. Sushi be looking. Sushi be trash. Hot garbage. Hot garbage. Wait, where was that thing where 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 he focused? At 9:30, thank you, my boy. Thank you. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, this right here. This right there. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that. Yeah, that right there. Right there. What is this? What is this? What the hell is this? Right here. What is this? What is what is going on here? Chinese food is gold. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Sad there's a new game plus. I'm sure they will be an update for sure. I love sushi, but I subscribe to you, man. Yo, thank you. Much love, king slash queen. Whatever you are, royalty to me. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to you. Um, much love, much love. Yeah, that is cool. So it looks like he was able to highlight. I want to see what is high. What's it looks like the horses are highlighted. I think I don't know if that's actually the case. I wonder what's because it because the guy's right there. Is the guy highlighted? Let me see. I can't tell. I think all the living things are highlighted. I think all yeah, it looks like some sort of Ingle vision. Yeah. Like it like it looks like a, any living thing is like a little bit gold, you know, around the or aurora. The aurora the, the aura, aurora, 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 aurora. Damn, yo my yo my boy you looking fire right there. Hold up. Hey yo, look at my hold up. This is the antagonist. I think that's Jin's uncle too. I think that's Jin's uncle, and I think that is the. I'm pretty no, not think. I know that's the antagonist in the Mongols. Hey yo, hold up! Look how fire my boy! Look how fucking fire my boy Jin looks, bro! Look at this! Look at him right here, bro! Are you kidding me? Maybe a click R three situation? Yeah, yeah, probably most likely. Yo, look how fire my boy Jin looks right now, bro! Ten out. Of ten. You know what? That calls for a calls for a screenshot. Hold up. My man Jin got that sauce, bro. Look at this man. Are you serious? Bro, are you serious? Okay. That's that's going to be the next thumbnail probably. I don't know, maybe. Yo, that thing looking fire. Oh, we gotta replay the the track. Dang, we were shooting for like forty minutes. Jim be looking mad right there too. This is definitely the interest of the game, I think, right here. Like, I think that's the initial Mongol invasion. I think maybe. All right, y'all. This game has multi. Oh uh, no, no, this game doesn't have multiplayer. No. Remember now, this gen Sony hates multiplayer in their games. I don't know why. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait for the next big, uh, the next big uh, multiplayer from first party Sony, which is probably going to be uh, Last of Us Part Two Factions. Which I need that shit. I need that so fast, bro. I need that now. Make sure to uh, ha ha follow our Twitter shameless plug at PSWordsBids.
follow that Twitter as well as down below in the description. You can follow our Discord as well as check out our anchor link to listen to our long form content and podcast format. That, of course, is in Road to Part 2 and Road to Ghost of Tsushima, as well as you can hit that join button to become a member to the channel. Hit up that Prince tier for only a do- guys, it's a dollar a month. It's a dollar a month. That's all I'm saying. It's a dollar a month. As well as you can hit us up with that King tier, uh, of course, with um, five dollars to be able to be shout out at every video and every podcast and look at stuff. Much love, much appreciate, all you people here. So we're from Sony. Hey, multiple. Yeah, no, it's. Tr- I mean, how the hell are you? You, you know what? I don't get too into it, but like, I think it's hilarious how. Sony starts charging for multiplayer this gen and puts out like no multiplayer games from first party. That just hurts my soul. It hurts. It hurts. Oh my god, that it would just fire too. That's a fire image. Mmm. I wanna see what they're talking about with the story. Cause that's an interesting thing to say. Cause I know that statement's gonna be wild. Owen hit us with that king tier. Can hey. Can I get triple GGs in the chat for my boy Owen? Triple GGs in my chat for Owen, please. Owen is the main homie. Big love to you, King. Big love to you, King. Big love, bro. Shout out to you, my boy. Oh, now, now, King, now Owen gets to use them emotes, bro. Owen gets to use them, uh, use them. Use some emotes, yo. That's fire. That's fire. Why the hell am I looking at Hello Kitty shit? I didn't realize this. I went over to a different tab. What the what the hell is going on? Seen that? Come on now. Monster kept you up there. Hey, yo, this is my coffee, bro. This is what keeping me up. This is what keeping me up, bro. Definitely. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I got my banana too, but I'm gonna wait to eat that. I only downstream. <laughs> um, okay, here we go. Let's read CNET's final thing. Finding balance. My experience with Ghost of Tsushima was most enjoyable when I dipped in and out of the game elements as the mood struck me. Rather than relentlessly pursuing the story, side quests, or upgrading items, the island is massive enough to support that approach, especially if you play over weeks or months rather than binging the whole game. Uh, the sorry, while rather than binging the whole lot in a fortnight. The last year of, of console generation's life cycle always brings some incredible games, and Ghost of PS4's open world is worth getting lost in. Okay, okay, overall. Okay, I feel that. Owen, I love you more, King. What kind of fire beats do you think Jin can play with his flu? Oh, we gonna find out. We gonna find... Oh, I see them using that KD hype emoji in the chat. Shout out to y'all. I see that. I see that. Um, let, Let's go back to Minute Quake for a little bit. Let's see what else we got popping. Saw someone also follow. Yo, shout out to Ronald Pennell for subscribing. Not subscribing. Following the uh, following the Twitter. Gotta love it, King. Gotta love it. I see you, King. I see you. I see you. I should probably change this for the Ghost of Tsushima stream. I'll, I'll fix that later. I'll fix that later. I forgot to do that. Um... Do we? Oh, let's read. Let's read IGN's review. Ghost of Tsushima. Well, this is not the full review. This is just a little, like you know, condensed, like for overall, you know. Ghost of Tsushima is an enormous and densely packed samurai adventure that often left me completely awestruck with both its visual spectacle and excellent combat. By steadily introducing new abilities instead of stat upgrades its sword play manages to stay challenging rewarding and fun throughout the entire 40 to 50 hours that it took me to beat the campaign a few aspects are surprisingly lacking in polish in comparison to other first party sony games especially when it comes to enemy ai and the stealth part of its stealth action split 
since still this is an extraordinary open world action adventure that solves several issues that have long gone unaddressed in that genre while also just being an all-around samurai slashing good time okay satellite super chat does not support my oh really you can't super chat Jogi? that's so sad ps5 is the biggest console ever even even bigger than my yeah i feel that i wish pre would open i don't even care that much about Ghost of Shima. Bro. Bro, I want. See, my whole thing is like, I just want the PS5 to go from here so, like, I can just put it on the credit card. It's done. Like, like I want to make sure, okay, cool. Like, I can rest easy. I will get a PS5 day one. You know what I'm saying? Um, but honestly, guys, I think we'll call it here. Like, I don't think there's really anything much that we can go into. Um, it is a. Oh, I mean, yo, it's going back. To, it went up to 84 now. Y'all see that? It's still moving, but I think it's the equal out to like an 84, around 85, I think. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I agree. So I was six points higher than my uh than my prediction. My second prediction, but my first my first prediction, I was I was definitely on point with that prediction. You know, like I was saying like I think like 86, 87, I think, or something like that. But I got too cocky. I brought it to a 90. That was that was that was all my bad. Um, I do want to read, actually, I want to read Greg Miller's tweets, actually. I see you. Robinson, shout out to you, King. Shout out to you. I see you, bro, following that. Uh, let me read Greg's tweets, though. Ghost of Tsushima is Sarko Bunch's best game ever and the latest standout in PlayStation Stellar exclusive lineup. Light up. Okay, cool. Looks like they're pretty positive on that, on the, on the uh, games cast. Um, but... Yeah, with that being said, y'all, with that being said, I think we're going to call it a stream. I love y'all. I'm probably going to get some more sleep. Actually, you know what? I, I, I'm pretty up right now. I might not sleep. I don't know. We'll see. Um, So, just a recap. Tonight, we will be live, and we're going to finish God of War Ascension. Uh, That's going down tonight. And then, of course, we're going to take a little break Wednesday night, uh, you know, and then Thursday, we'll go into Ghost of Tsushima stream series. Uh, will Ghost of Tsushima come to PS5? Yeah. Ghost of Tsushima will, will, will come to PS5 as well. Um, again, much, much love to you all who came over to the stream. I really appreciate you guys. Uh, much love to you, Kings. Much love. Make sure to hit us down below in the description where you can find links to, once again, our Twitter, our Discord, as well as the Anchor link. To listen to a long form content and podcast from like that, of course, being Road to Part 2 and Road to Ghost of Tsushima. As well as make sure to check out um, Ghost of Tsushima, Road to Ghost of Tsushima, which is going up on Sunday. We will cover our first impressions. Me and Arachnite will go over our first impressions and our thoughts on the game, as well as playthrough. Stream series Ghost of Tsushima starts Thursday night. Be there. It's lit. It's hype. We're going to do it big. Um, and once again, like, like the video if you enjoyed it, as well as stay subscribed to PlayStation Store to keep up with the latest and greatest in PlayStation. Do also consider, <laughs> uh, joining the channel as a member, you know what I'm saying? Hit it, hitting us with that Prince tier or that King tier, you get access to emotes and stuff like that. Um, make, make sure to definitely, you know, consider that if you will so kindly do so. And uh, let's see what we got. Double Shooter says, great stream. Wish my internet wouldn't be so messed up. I should be on God of War uh, stream tonight. Okay, fire, 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 fire. Is Ghost of Tsushima streams goes five hours in each part? I don't know, Chungi. Um, Chungi, it might be like five hour parts, maybe. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, but but thank God for coming out. Much love. I see you, Kings. Owen, fucking King tier. I love you, bro. Much love, King. Much love. And, um... Yeah, I think we'll call it there. Um, a video might go up today. Definitely, a video will will go up tomorrow. I, I I have a PS5 video coming up. Um, maybe one more ghost video. I'm thinking maybe one more ghost video, but we will have to see. And um, yeah, guys, much love to you all. Um, I'll see you guys tonight. If you guys can be here on stream tonight for God of War Ascension, the finale of that game. Uh, cause no matter what, no matter how long it takes, we are beating it to we are beating it tonight. There is no question. We are we are beating it tonight. And uh, I'm going to eat this banana. <laughs> Probably going to maybe sleep a little bit. I'm not sure. We'll see. Maybe. I, I will fix this damn hair, though. 
I will fix this damn hair because this hair looking disgraceful. This hair is looking horrible right now. Definitely going to fix this hair. But, uh, yeah, guys, much love to you all. Thank you for coming in the stream. See you guys tonight. If you're going to be here tonight, make sure to follow at PSource Vids. Follow the Discord. Follow Anchor Link, all the good stuff. And uh, thank you for coming out. And as always, greatness awaits.